12.53 a.m. Angel, Rodrigo and Siavash are in the living room. How many girls did you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Fuck, you know. Two. <laughs> two. Two. I was joking. Two? Yeah. Did you have a proper relationship or just... Yeah, proper. Proper relationship? How old were you? Oh, God, it's like... A... Are you... Are you... I want a police. <laughs> I'm just interested. There's nothing no, wrong young. with it. I was young. What about you? How many girls? Many. Many people. Uh, How many you were? Girlfriends and yeah. stuff. Oh. Lost count, my friend, lost count. Halfwit and Lisa are at the Ready, bus you know stop. I mean? I'm a kind woman, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And I don't like anybody being there, anybody upset, but when I lose it, I just, uh, you know, I've done it before, I go off and then I need just to get away from the situation and then I, I have a thing and then I think, oh, maybe it was a bit, a bit stupid. Forget it, do you know what I mean? So that's it, it's forgotten, you know, oh. if that's all right with you, you know what I mean? That's absolutely all right But in me. a house, it, yeah. for all the day I was thinking of my family, my friends, I knew they would be watching, yeah. you know, and it, I, they, I was like, you should have saw how quiet I went last, you know, on Sunday on the evictions. Yeah. I, evictions, I, I don't think I can handle the evictions. Mm. I get really like, we, I do miss the people on the outside. Yeah. Me right, too. So, you know what I mean? You gotta mm. click that in. Yep. Thank you very much. But obviously, you, you know, you never held it on and you was talking and I thought, I'm not going not, to not gonna fall out with him. Do you know what I mean? I thought, mm. I'm going to be out, cos we do get on, we sing yeah. and that. It's just, I was stuck in that room, it done my head in. Yeah, we good came of it. I think we're, we're adopting a, a positive culture for the bedroom yeah. now. Some of the housemates are in the bedroom. Mm -hmm. Like no, I'm coming to you, you not coming to me. Like. Yes, it is. You yeah. guys meant to do all the work. Yeah. Oh, yeah, me coming over to you. Yeah. Like a maggot voice. <laughs> it's my lap dog. Fuck you. <laughs> Carly is in the diary room. Marcus is a disgusting, grotty, sexist pig, and I can't stand him. Day by day, he keeps making stupid wee comments. He just walks about, gets on everybody's nerves, and he's, he's really, really grating on me. I cannot stand him. I'll leave that one more time, but I swear to God, one more time that he says one comment to me, and I'm going to go, I'm going to lose that with him. I can't stand him. I think he's a disgusting pig. What exactly has Marcus said to upset you tonight, Carly? He says, um, oh, we've all been put in here for a reason. Um, you and Sophie's been put in here because you's are pieces of meat. Blah, 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 blah. Talking the biggest load of shite ever. Pieces of meat. I do think so. Have you tried speaking to Marcus about how you're feeling? No. I, I, I don't even really want to talk to him. I don't even want to spend time with him. I do want to waste my breath on him. And that's another thing. His breath is absolutely hoaching. It gives me the book. He washes his body with a Brillo pad. I felt like saying, here, pal, you need to brush your teeth with the Brillo pad. It, it's, no, it's needless. There's no need for it. That's another thing that annoys me. Do you think Marcus is aware about how you're feeling? He knows that, that I dislike him. There's, there's something between us. You can just tell. I've avoided him as much as I can in here because I just can't be arsed with him. I've avoided him. And um, I can't be bothered with him, so I'm going to continue to do that. And we're going to bother trying with a relationship, because there is no relationship. He's not the kind of person I want to associate myself with. He's not the kind of person that I want to agree, disagree with. I've no time for the guy. 4.24 a.m. All of the housemates are in the bedroom. Dogface is in Chris's bed. 